I have worked with many sound recordists around the world, but none have been as interesting as Arnandel uh, here in India. He's been an extraordinary guy to work with. He has such a passion for the quality of the recorded sound and understands that, you know, sound isn't just about uh, the lines that an actor says. It's not just about what's happening in the background, but it's also the feeling that a scene can evoke through sound. Uh, I think that many uh, times we forget uh, as uh, directors and cinematographers and such that that sound is really 70% of the experience. You know, I think an audience will forgive things uh, if it's not technically exactly like it should be when they're watching on s the screen, but when they listen to it, if it doesn't ring true, if it's something that they don't, uh, if they don't believe that place or if they don't believe that setting uh, audibly, then they don't believe what's on the screen. So I think that both of those uh, aspects are so intermingled and it's important not to ever uh, rush that experience. You want to make sure you get the audio right, you want to make sure that you get uh, the pieces of that audio right. So if I'm in a small village, what are the sounds of those villagers? Uh, you need to know that. And I think that working here with him in India, I have really been able to accomplish that and capture those moments that uh, we may not have been able to capture otherwise. I think here in some ways that recording audio is more complicated than it is in other places and that's not to say that it's a cakewalk to record audio anywhere in the world but I think here in India especially and particularly on this project you know we've filmed in some remote villages where people don't have electricity or television uh, so when a camera crew comes in and we bring in actors and recorders and cameras and you know hundreds of people you have a lot of people that want to watch and you can't really control those crowds. It's something that I've never experienced before in my life uh, because I'm used to, you know, if I'm filming something, we have the set blocked off and that's that. But here you have to kind of navigate that when you're shooting in specific locations. And I think that uh, here the job of the recordist is definitely uh, more challenging because you have to figure out how to isolate the audio in places that uh, it's very difficult to isolate. So I think here it's uh, more of a challenge and requires someone that can meet those challenges. There are very few sound recordists I have worked with that are as passionate and as gifted as Anandar is. Uh, he has been spectacular throughout uh, the filming process. Anytime I have a question about something uh, related to audio, Anandar has a succinct and very specific answer. He always knows exactly what we need to do and that doesn't just pertain to the recording of the actors performances but also to the ambient sound around us. Uh, when you're filming in India, especially in remote villages, there are lots of people that come out to watch, sometimes hundreds at a time, and Andenor knows exactly what to do with not just the actors, but also how to capture those sounds and how to make uh, something that's unique in sound design so that we can actually uh, create that feeling of what that village is like for an audience. Uh, it's one thing to show something visually, but it's totally something else uh, to do it audibly. Uh, and it actually teleports that audience to that place when they can hear it and not just see it. And I think Anandar does an excellent job of doing that. So I can't wait to work with him again in the future.